And just pass the mic around. This is a family reunion, so we want you to know each other. So take the mic and just share just briefly who you are, where you're from. And, yeah. um, my name is Mohammed, and, and I'll be working with uh, my as a partner. And uh, I think we've worked from 2007 up to now. Yeah, thank you. My name is Staten Heard. This is my wife, Sandra. We're here for the first time in Ghana. Uh, we're hoping to connect and hopefully maybe even do some uh, business transactions. We've been to Africa probably five or six times, maybe a dozen or so countries. But uh, first time in Ghana, we like what we see. We're happy to be home. Everybody try to speak up to the mic a little harder. Okay. Uh, my name is Wayne Jones. Uh, I have done work here in Ghana, uh, in Bogota, uh, Texas, and uh, I'm a consultant engineering company. Uh, yeah, engineering company. And we do everything they need here airports, roads, bridges, trains. Hospitals, schools, all that stuff. And uh, I'm here uh, to understand what's needed here with my partners, which are waiting for me to come back to Atlanta. We have about 150 people to work for us all over the country. And we've done work here before. So hopefully I can make some connections here and continue to work. Uh, uh, the, the gentleman we worked with before was John Williams out of Chicago. He had passed. So we were able to finish the project. It's Wayne John. So the company is Copper, Copper Engineering Consultants, to let you know that people uh, of color have been great engineers in different states and everything else around the world. I'm on stage. I'm on stage. Please put the mic to your mouth and speak up because we can't get your audio. My name is Justice. I'm going to back. I might keep on the same thing.
name is Zozo, and I'm into sustainable architecture. Zo TV in the house. And I have a demand with the Zo TV camera happening here. My channel is now on Pan African Focus. Stories around Africa, Africans in Africa, Africa beyond the continent. So that is where my story is. And I'm into sustainable architecture as well. I build with natural soil, remnant construction, and wood construction. So welcome to Ghana again. Please talk. Kofi Mensa, that's my granddad, Dr. Asari. I've been under him learning so much, and uh, it's a privilege for me to be here to learn. Thanks very much. My name is Mr. Asamwa. I'm a brother of Mr. Asari, Dr. Asari. Hello, good evening to you all. My name is um, Rafia Ahmed. I'm into avocado processing. We do everything avocado, avocado oil, avocado seed powder, and avocado tea, and some herbal tea. We make sure we bring healthier stuff because and a lot of people do not know that avocado seed powder actually heals. And they've been throwing it away in Ghana. It healed me of my high blood pressure. And so um, I guess I want to tell the whole world they can use Ayurvedic and herbals to treat themselves. So you're all welcome to Ghana. Thank you. My name is Walbeck. Builder. My brother will back in the house. That has worked with uh, Bravo Money for a very long time. Very good. Yes, dear? Come on, you have to move. Yeah, 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 we're going to get you up here. <laughs> so, probably I'm here to support and to enlighten and to welcome my brothers from the diaspora. That you are welcome and we are ready to receive you, to work with you, and to move the African continent forward. You are welcome. Yeah, good evening. My name is Julie. Julie. Yeah, I'm into forest training. Mm -hmm. I, just, uh, I, I, I operate the forest bureau. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so if you have your dollars, your euros, your pounds, just see you from good rates. There you go, brother. Uh, get him, get him. <laughs> Location, airport. Airport uh, city. I'm a lawyer, Ghana Revenue Authority, and for a UCL Law Consult. And I'm also the Chief Executive Officer for InGuide Solutions Limited. And I would say uh, Amaraba, as we say from Northern Ghana. So Amaraba, welcome. Here for you, if you like. Okay. She always she's a little shy, but she's uh, dynamic lawyer and kind of friend. Okay. Good evening, everybody. My name is Jasmine. Okay. I it's my first trip to the motherland. I'm here to experience the country and to meet my people. <laughs> Coaching, we do nutritional coaching. We help uh, people move from toxic eating onto a healthy lifestyle. Thank you.
for the first time to Africa from Washington State. Just um, wanting to see what's happening and um, see if I can get involved in some work. Hello, everybody. My name is Naomi. I'm from Florida, and I'm traveling for the first time to Ghana, but not to Africa. And my family, my husband, my son, and daughter-in-law, they all traveled with us. And we're enjoying everything we've learned thus far, and plan to learn a lot more. Possibly ownership. Just hang in there with us. Good evening, everyone. I'm sure you can hear me, correct? Yeah. Okay, I want to make sure. My name is Madam V. Actually, my name is Berlisha Ace King. I'm from America, from California. My daughter, Niger, and I have been here for seven years. And where do I begin? I'm involved in so many different things. Um, I head a coalition uh, named Diaspora Headquarters. And Diaspora Headquarters' basic aim is to bring our community together because we can talk about investments, we can talk about holistic health, but holistic health, health is the whole person. So there's a lot of healing that we need to do coming from the West because there are so many things that we definitely have to endure. We have a project through Diaspora Headquarters called Phantom Healing Chapel, and we do groups that go into different areas where there are areas where we need to see them. There's a gentleman that's with us now who is still very terrified, and I can relate to this, whenever even a Ghana policeman is behind me. Because I know what we go through, go in the West, if a cop is back there, we don't know what's going to happen. So there's, and that's just a, the tip of the iceberg. There's so many different areas where we need healing. And to unify with our brothers and sisters here in Ghana or on the continent as a whole, we have to learn how to unify too, okay, to make that more effective. So that's one coalition or one project I'm involved in. I also want to talk to my brother back here because we have a company called Welcome to Earth. And we build earth homes. So, and we deal with Atwani building. So, I want to talk to you. Absolutely. So there are so many different things that we're involved in. And we're also into interior decorating and interior design. Okay, so it's a whole lot, but we're happy to be here. Thank you. I'm quite cool. I'm here to, to see how I can, I can get involved to help Africa with this development. Good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Seymour. Uh, you met my wife earlier, and my son and his wife are also here with us. Um, I have for the last nine or ten years, I've uh, been trying to make a plan to return to the continent. I was watching a guy called Guatemala. I don't know if you all are familiar with him, but that was my introduction about 12 years ago. Uh, since then, I've watched many other YouTubers, but um, my curiosity, uh, I should say first, uh, this is our second trip to the continent, first trip to Ghana. Uh, but my curiosity is that uh, I might find something here and establish, uh, reestablish my family here. Um, that's the hope. God bless you. My name is Charles. Uh, I first came to Ghana November 2018 with Bomani, and I just happened to be here this month when I found out his schedule was bringing him to here this month, so I wanted to stop by. Good evening. I don't need that. You can hear me, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, my name is Arlene Cameron Lloyd. I am an educator for over 30 years. 
my nonprofit company in Jacksonville, Florida, is Tristan's Acceleration Academy. And our goal is to teach children not only a correct history, but we also work with agriculture. So we started a small farm at our school, and we are looking to connect with people who can help us grow. My name is Alicia, and I'm here to learn more about the, rep the, the, the process of investing in Africa. I'm very glad to be here and to uh, get to know people and um, brainstorm, and hopefully I can bring something um, valuable to the table. I'm a social worker, so I'm always looking at ways that uh, the community can interact with the individual. Um, I'm looking at the person in the environment and how they can best Fly and be self sufficient. Hello, hello. My name is Lovett Brooks. They call me Jalo. Uh, this is my third trip to Ghana. My first time with Bomani, my bridge with Bomani, my bridge with Jaface. Uh, what I do, my company is Digital Technologies. What we do, we build infrastructure. We're cable uh, telecom contractors. So we work for the big companies like Comcast, Charter Spectrum, Cost Communication. We build infrastructure, telecom, fiber optics, coax cable, and whatever goes along with it. Also, we can do things for the electrical grid. We do have a lot of electricians, top-notch electricians that can come in and do. So my purpose here is, one, it's always been my dream to live here, to come back home. And not only myself, but I look to bring many others. I want to be that conduit to bring many others. So my interest here is, of course, to help build a telecom because it's so vital that we have uh, advanced or up-to-date telecommunications that will help advance. I see Ghana here is nice, they're building all nice everywhere, but without this type of infrastructure, power and telecommunications, we're still limited as far as business, mm -hmm. commerce, you know, trade, ideas, education. <coughs> so I'm here to, I will give, I will donate, I will do as much as I can freely. I do need help. Um, my people, I will bring my guys, my teams and contractors to help. Um, but like I said, we need some concessions, we need help. You can't do it alone, you understand? And uh, also I'm willing to train. I want to train all the young youth for telecom business, how to splice fiber out the cable, how to put up fiber, how to put up the electricity, electrical system, how to do everything so we can build our own telecom. We're not going to outsource it to England, Germany, China, or whoever. We can do it for ourselves. We don't have to pay them. We don't have to pay them. We just take care of ourselves. My goal is to get, and also, in addition with that, like I said, educate them. I want to get these all our young boys, our young men, and our young women off the streets. That is my mission. I'll get them off the streets. Greetings, family. My name is Jeff S. As a said. I've been doing for money about 15 plus years now. I'm actually a tradesman. Uh, I'm a painter, welder. My mom would describe me as a jack of all trades, master of some. <laughs> there you go. More so, at this time, I'm a DJ. Music is my love, music is my life, music is my heart. I've been DJing since 1994. And I'm willing to work with my people in Africa, the whole of Africa, not just Ghana. Uh, my first visit to Africa was actually in Tanzania, and I loved it. Um, and ever since, I was with Wipo Money then as well. And um, I'm grateful to be here, the yeah, your presence, and uh, my future definitely is in Africa. Here for Pittsburgh. This is my first time in Ghana. Uh, I 
came originally because it was my birthday. It's a way for me to celebrate my birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. But I also wanted to find a connection. You know, I needed to feel a connection, right? I needed to feel that. And so I needed to step my foot on the ground. Right? I needed to do that. I needed to feel my folks. Yes. Right? I needed to see your face. I needed to hear your voice. I needed your hugs. I needed all of that. And so that's why I'm here to get that and to give that. So thank you for just being here, being you, being in the space. Um, and that's all.